having zero zero engineers is better than just upgrading the one. Because as you can see, those three zero zeros cost around the same as this upgraded engineer, and I mean it's pretty obvious to see which one defended better. Always use the Sabo ability at the start of round 20, especially if your opponent has been aggressive and is not ecoing. It's basically called permastalling. It makes sure that the BFB or ZooMG or whatever it is, is permanently stalled. So it won't go fast again like it would if you didn't permastall it, you used it after the balloon came out. It's kind of hard to predict the timing for it, but doing that at the start of round 20, is normally the best time to do it. And you can defend BFBs pretty easily, as you can see there. With good stalling, you can defend around 27 or lower, 0MG, with pretty little defense. All you need is just six balloon jutsus and around two to three balloon traps with, of course, getting up that sabotage supply lines when the balloon goes fast again. So you could try and perma-stall the 0MG, by using the sabotage ability before the ZMG comes out, but it's kind of hard to predict when they're going to send one. You could do it at the start of round 22, but the problem with that is they most likely wouldn't send you one because ZMGs are very expensive for early on rounds. I would, I would want to start perma stalling maybe round 30 and after because that's when they'll probably start to rush you. And yeah, as you can see, we defend that pretty well there. We did stall well enough to defend. Could have timed it a bit better, but doesn't matter that much. All you need is six balloon jutsus and two or three balloon traps. So DFA can outlast NFE. So DFA is a big threat for NFE, it's a good counter. So if you're going NFE, you're gonna want to be aggressive to the DFA users. So the Ninja Destruction upgrade is crucial for defending ceramics. So when that mob gets popped, you wanna have that destruction upgrade to push back those ceramics into that balloon trap. But if you don't have it, then this is what it's gonna happen to you, most likely. Yeah, not looking too good, is it? <laughs> the ninja, the NG ability is basically useless for NFE. It's pretty expensive and it's basically just like a one tower tower boost. Not worth it, just save your tower boosts and you'll be fine. Gummelids are another big threat for NFE, especially if they are region, so you want about a bloom trap, a flash bomb, and a double shot at the minimum. You might need a balloon jitsu if the rush is bigger, but as you can see, we defended that just fine. If you can guess the right amount of ninjas, I'll buy you club access, or if you already have it, I will give you a shout out. NFE is really, really good at defending lots of mobs. Here are the best spots for all of your towers. <laughs> 